guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here go ahead and click that subscribe button and if you're not welcome back so um i'm gonna kind of just quickly and when i mean quickly i mean very quickly show y'all how i package my cosmetic orders and um go ahead Put the bag down. I'm gonna just quickly show you guys how I package my cosmetic orders because um my phone's about to die and my area is already in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just go to my Shopify app, load orders, and then I got two orders to fulfill. So I have one. I'm trying to see what's gonna show. Okay, so I have one, and it's for a t-shirt and a highlighter, and then I have one that is just a makeup palette. So I'm going to show you guys how I package it. I didn't do the shirt yet, but y'all can still see how I do what I do. So let's get into the video. Ignore my area. Life for entrepreneur. So I'm just going to my drawer. I already had this, so this is the palette that I need, and then the Press Babe Pressed Highlighter in the Glow Babe one, which is the gold one. This drawer here, and this has some of my packaging, so I'm gonna get this one, and then I need a small one. And then I'm gonna get a small one. Okay, cool. So what I'm gonna do is, I already have a um, sticker on this one. It says Carol Couture. This was the first one I printed and I had just put it on there just cause I don't wanna waste a sticker. But I'm still use it anyway. And this is the palette that was ordered. The Shimmer Me palette. Is it? Yeah. Is that what it's called? Yeah, call me Shimmer. And this is the palette that was ordered. So, make sure it's right. Then I'm going to just stick it back in here. And that's it really for this. So, as far as this one, I'm going to print out a label to go on here. So, I have these two labels. One is for shipping and one is for my round labels and this isn't the avery ones but it says same size as avery 22817 so i'm going to block this go to avery.com and my project I already have three projects up, so I have one that says k Royal Cosmetics, this is the first one that I printed, and then I have this one that just says thank you. So I'm going to actually print this one and see how it looks. So we're going to click open, and then it is going to pop up, and then I like to actually like look at this, and then it shows me how to actually going to look so after I do that I'm gonna go to preview and print oh actually let me go back because I don't want to print that many sheet yes yeah, so I'm gonna go to level one preview and print oh print yourself print range so I'm gonna go print and I'm just going to print number two and then two of two. So that's how I'm going to print this one. I'm actually going to print a lot. I'm actually going to print on um, two of them because I'm going to put one on here. And then this one already has one. But I'm going to put a sticker on here because um, this one isn't being shipped. So I'm going to just print two out. 
So we open it, take it out, and this is how they look. I already used one. And then you just click print now. You open the PDF. And then that's how that is. So now come over here. My printer. My shirts. I just did a bulk order of shirts. So I'm just going to stick it in my printer. Like so. Yeah. Okay. Stick it in my printer. Like that. Then we're gonna come back over here and then I'm gonna do print. Make sure it's in color. And it says you're supposed to do print using system settings, but honestly just regular print. Um present color copies one. Cause when I do, oh, maybe if I do photo glossy paper, I'm gonna try that. Hmm. Yeah, let me try that and see what happens. Okay, then we're gonna hit print. Make sure we start printing. Yep. This is a trial and error I just did because I never did print as a glossy paper. But I mean, it is a glossy paper, so. This is how it looks. Hmm, actually looks really good. Okay, ignore my background. I don't feel like setting all this stuff up. So, I printed out the stickers. This is how they look. I think these papers were like $3 at Walmart. I got them both for Walmart. And it comes with five sheets and 60 labels, which is not bad. So, I have these two. And I'm basically going to take this container and I'm gonna put my label right in the middle so I'm gonna fill it off and then I'm gonna kind of like just basically put it here like so and this is Carol Cosmetics. Yeah, I think that's the key. I think that's the key, babe. Gotta do it as a photo glossy paper. I will not touch it. Does it? Yeah. Okay. So since this is actually a part of a different order, I'm going to stick it in here. Like I said, this goes with a shirt, but and then I'm gonna get a business card, and it says, um, these are my new ones actually, and then this is the back, I love them so much, and I'm just gonna stick the business card in there. And then I'm going to get my thank you cards. They just say K Royal Couture. And then in the back, can't show y'all the code, but it says thank you for shopping. Hashtag Royal Cutie. Use code blank blank at checkout on your next purchase. Can't you just like blur it? Let me just do this. Let me just show y'all that part. So. This order goes with a t-shirt, but I'm still going to put it in here. And 
just gonna peel it off. Actually, should I bubble wrap this a little? Yeah, I think I'm gonna bubble wrap it just as well. It should be okay. Yeah. Yeah, it should be alright. And then you just fold it. And boom. That's how you do it. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna take the palette and I'm going to do this. Right. Oh. Mm. Hold it like this. And then I'm gonna take it. And I'm gonna just fold it again. Now I could have just put it in there, but it kind of just gives it a little more support. Now can the bubble wrap in this fit in here? It's already well, like it's already padded in here. But still. All right, y'all. So I was freaking recording, and like the air conditioner is literally messing it up. So basically, I'm going to just continue to do a voiceover. So I'm going to grab another business card like I did for the last order. And I'm just going to put the business card in the package. And then afterwards, I'm also going to get a um, thank you card. Like I said earlier, this does have a coupon code in it for my customers to, you know, come back and shop with me. Just rip it off and then seal it just like you would any other one. I know a lot of people are waiting for the lashes trust me i'm waiting too i literally like i paid for them the first of this month and like um i'm getting custom packaging so i had to work with the vendor and the designer and they've been they've been designing it and then like i ain't gonna say they were taking too long but like i understood that it takes like they told me it would take like 10 to 15 days and I was like, okay. And then like literally today, they just told me that, you know, they sent me the box over to confirm and they were like, okay, cool. Now we will start working on the box today. So hopefully it should be out by this week. And then that means that I should get them in hopefully next week, which is like the week of 15, 17, 18, 19, 20. The week of the 22nd, I should have them. So basically the last week, cause I know y'all waiting for the lashes. I'm so excited. I hope you're excited too. Um, As always, my business is K-Royal Couture. My, the Instagram is K-Royal Couture. And then you can go to kroyalcouture.com. You can follow us on Facebook at K-Royal Couture. And then um, these packages are so cute. You can just go go to um the description box and find all the info you need such as the website the links of the instagram the links of the facebook all that then also my social media handles are down below shop with k world couture get get your makeup period period say bake say period boo period <laughs> Period. But thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.